I'm going to do here now a a, a topic. <coughs> excuse me. That was lost in a recent knowledge check. Okay, and that's this one here. I guess I'm going to do maybe all of these, but for now, this one: predicting the relative lattice energy of binary ionic compounds. All right, so pretty scary. All right, we're going to find that it ends up being a derivative of something <coughs> that we already learned, and that is the um, understanding the relationship between charge and separation and ele electrostatic potential. Okay, so <coughs> sorry, I think I will pepper my nose. All right. In each row, pick the compound with the bigger lattice energy. Now, first of all, notice here, the lattice energy is always greater than zero. And that means that the more tightly something is bound, the harder it is to get it apart. So the lattice energy is gonna be, you know what? Let me put this in my whiteboard. The lattice energy is gonna be the amount of energy it takes to pull something apart. And that I got because I read the explanation, all right? So here we go. The lattice energy is always greater than zero, and that means that the harder it is to pull something apart, the more the lattice energy is. So all right, let's first look, look at this first one. So the first one is lithium and bromide. Lithium is small, bromide is big, and then it's sodium and bromide, right? And so which of these two is closer? Which is closer? Which is more tightly held? That one is closer, right? Because we're talking about the centers of mass. So the center of mass of this small guy is closer to the center of the big guy than these two, right, in comparison. So consequently, it's gonna be harder to pull these apart. All right, therefore, that's got the higher lattice energy. <clears throat> All right. Okay, now let's look at cesium and iodide. So cesium is, looks like this, and iodide looks like this, right? And barium iodide looks like this, two plus and a minus and a minus, right? So can you see that, that in order to pull these guys apart, I've got a bigger, a, not, not a bigger in, um, in size necessarily, but a bigger in charge. So remember <clears throat> when I have more charges, they're harder to pull apart, right? They're lower in potential energy or higher in lattice energy. So this is the one that's gonna be harder to pull apart. It's gonna require higher, la higher lattice energy and there we go. Okay. And then finally, let's change colors because it's getting a little bit crowded here. And then finally we have calcium which is a two plus and a chloride, which is a minus and a minus, that's chloride. Or we have a calcium, which is two plus and, an, and a fluoride, because they're smaller, right? Look on the periodic table, fluoride's a lot smaller than chloride, okay? So if that's the case, these are gonna be harder to pull apart because they're closer, closer, harder to pull apart. They're closer because it's the centers that we're counting, right? Remember that? So it's the center of that to the center of that is less than the center of that to the center of that, okay? And so that is going to be, the, have the highest ladder, the higher lattice energy, all right? Okay, hope that's helpful.